it's 1047 and uh, my day started a little bit early. Um, thankfully, I was able to uh, have a easy time this morning. I got a duffel bag sorted out for if I want to go to the gym after this. I've got uh, some Amazon returns, but one of the emails my dad sent me doesn't have a scannable code in it. And I don't have his Amazon login. So the UPS store is not happening today. I'm going to try to hit Kohl's at some point. And if not, the stuff is already in the car. So when I get to that point, I don't have to remember and go track it all down. But I am out a good 30 miles from home. Going to go to my specialist. Going to get multiple injections in the back of my shoulders. I am... I am regretting not moving this appointment up following the car accident and I had folks who mean well but don't know me well enough to know patting me on the back yesterday. Clinch City. Thankfully I also have somebody who knows very very well what's up with my shoulders who was trying on Christmas to help me not guard so much. <sighs> it's the guarding that causes most of the clenching. Anyway, um, I've got half an hour till my appointment time. So I'm going to try to get a video uh, handled. Even might have my headphones. Keep an eye on the time. And then um, injections. Then I get to drive home. So that's how my day is looking. I'm uh, working on protein coffee. I weighed myself this morning, and even though I'm trying to keep my weight at 125-ish for uh, for the winter, specifically January and February, which is when it's coldest here, um, I had a really hard time getting above 118, and I was stuck at like 123 for a long time. Holiday food, thank goodness, pushed me up to, like, it was 127 this morning. Which is, like, a pound up from a month ago. <laughs> right after Thanksgiving. So, uh, I feel like I'm doing pretty good. I don't want to hit 130, but then again, I would be warm-ish. I mean, not by much. I think the coat pants are really where it's at, but I'm gonna... I'm gonna keep an eye on uh, on that. Try not to like get out of hand. Definitely gonna stay in the normal range, and then um, just bring it back down again, carefully and slowly, around the end of February to the end of March. Nope, it's not gonna be difficult because I've I've got a handle on it now. I just need to take it easy on the sweets. Like that regular non-diet Pepsi that I had yesterday. Drink some water. A few of these. I'll be alright. But I guess I also need to keep an eye on how much muscle I can build. It won't be much. And most of it will be in the legs, I'm sure. But man, my, my knee is bugging me a day. And it has been for a couple of days. And I'm thinking exercise bike maybe I don't know I haven't been to the gym yet I am a little concerned what my attitude is going to be like but I do have like half an hour of driving for the, the attitude to kind of come down a little bit before I'd even have the option to get to the gym so we'll see what kind of first impressions I leave but um yeah I'm gonna try to do some editing see if I can do that and then uh run in here and talk to my doctor. Possibly also regarding what uh, what I'd be looking at and what his advice would be regarding CBD products. Because I have not messed with those. But Tylenol doesn't even make a dent. And I can't have Advil. And I can't have Aleve. So... If there's a chance that that could be a better alternative 
than the rather scary stuff that I'm currently on and trying not to do more than once a month. That could be good for me. We're going to have to find out. I'm going to have to bring in a professional on this and get some solid advice. Okay. This 318 I just got done uh, on my first gym trip in a while. And I've changed. I'm feeling pretty good. Uh, I've been drinking some water. I finish up Sasperl. I got it, Bucky's. Um, I have band aids in obvious places, so I had kept my hoodie on. Oh wow, those are close together. And um, I think I burned off the low grade rage that hits with that. Uh, I like the way my new flip flops look, but it don't so much like walking in them, mostly because I hate flip-flops. Anyway, um, yep, looking cute. I'm probably going out to dinner with somebody, so, oh, I, I should have the brush. I'm trying to think how lightweight I can keep it when my gym get bag gets here tomorrow, and, uh, still have everything I need. Oh, man. Stuff. I got a decent workout. I did uh, four miles on a recumbent bike. Um, a little bit um, of machines. Uh, one where you hold onto this thing and then you you twist your knees and and you get um, it works your middle side to side, right? And uh, there's another one where you, your feet are on this bar, and it's like it's it's like you're sitting, and there's a bar across your leg, and your feet are out like this, and you push the thing down, whatever that is. I did that for a while too, in the hopes that my knee would feel better. And you know what? It felt a lot better afterwards. With my tunes rolling, and um, nobody talked to me. Not a lot of people were masked up, but everybody was spaced out, so I like that, and, um, just spaced out. Alright, time to go see if Cole's ha near me has a Amazon return thing. Uh, at least one of these I know I can do. The other one, we'll find out. Okay, it's 4.33, and I just got, uh... And it calls. The return was super easy. The, the Amazon return thing it was really, really easy. But then, these tricky, tricky stores. Uh, they handed me a $5 calls cash for doing my return with Amazon. So, of course, you know, I go through all the stuff and look. I went through the whole entire bra department, right? Like five times, I think. Going, well, I kind of need one, but bras are so hard to fit, you know? Well, earrings are always the right size. And there's two of them. Kind of like a bra. So, that's what I did. Let's see if I can find my flipping piercing. Ow. I am really bad at this. It hasn't closed up. I've used it recently. Here we go. Maybe it has closed up a little. There. Ha. Got him. With a lever back, so I can leave them in. Just little black rectangles. I like it. It's a uh, Vera Wang, and I guess it was on sale for like, buy one, get one half off, but I don't need two pairs of Vera Wang. Is it Vera or Vera? Why am I asking myself I'm the only one in the car? Is there the off chance anybody ever actually watches? Ouch. This, I'm sure they'll let me know. People like to correct others on the internet. I've had to make myself stop doing that. Because honestly, I don't care. So why bother? Ooh. There! I'm in a dress with earrings on. I'm a classy lady. Let me rubber band my uh, mirror cover back into place. 
don't tell anybody. I don't want them to think I can't get dirt under my fingernails with the best of them. Kick it. Okay, let me start off with oops. <laughs> so, last night, and this is the morning of 28th, though, so this is going to be the 27th video recap. Um, last night, went out to dinner. It was fun. I've actually still got my earrings on. We had planned to go see a movie after going for dinner, but dinner took so flippin' long that we would have had to wait till 10 p.m. Not happening. So, uh, decided to go home, watch, uh, Wizard People, Dear Readers, which is like the best alternate soundtrack for Harry Potter and Sorcerer's Stone ever. And it's just so much fun, and it's Brad Neely thing. And I used to have it on on CDs, two CDs, uh, and you had to to get started at just the right time, kind of like Dark Side of the Moon and The Wizard of Oz. Well, it's it's humor and it's great. And also, while I was having my pizza, I may have drank my beer a little too fast, so. I had to have some time to relax and get past it before getting my car back to the house. So, uh, by the time all of that was done, I was, I was just exhausted and I've been needing my sleep. So I fell asleep and I kept fully intending to get up, get changed into my pajamas and recap and instead I fell asleep in my dress. Oh well. It was a good day, but man, I, um, I needed a break. So thanks for sharing that day with me. <laughs>